Welcome back everybody, this is Brian again with Super Tech Services and we have another video today. It's one we've been asked a couple times by some of the members of the community so I thought I'd make a video. Today we're going to show you how to change the language on a Konica Biz Hub. This should work on pretty much all of them and I'm going to show you two to three different ways how to do it. So let's get started. Alright, so I'm in English right now. I'm just going to press the menu key at the very top, hit the utility button, number two user settings and then go to number one system settings and then right there number one language settings and then you can change the language just like so and if it's in another language first you can just follow the exact same keys I pressed um, and you'll be able to get in as you can see I'm gonna do menu utility number two number one and number one and then you're back in the language section now that's from the main screen. I'm going to show you two other ways to do it through tech rep mode. So let's get started. On this one, we're going to do, say you have some kind of weird air or something, so I'm just going to power the machine down, hold the reset button, power the machine on while continuing to hold the reset button for a little bit. This will bring you into tech rep mode manually. So like I said, say you have some kind of issue where you can't get to the main screen or there's some kind of weird error code or something and you need to change the language, um, this will work for you. All right, so this does take a little bit of while. As you can see, I took my hand off the reset button now and I'm just going to let it boot up into tech rep mode. All right, there we go. This is also the screen where you can hit trouble reset if you would like. But from here, just press stop 00, stop 01 like usual. Then you're going to put the CE password in, which is normally 9272 four times. Okay, this is the third one here, 9272. And then we're going to do it one more time. And then hit the end button. All right, now that we're in, you're just going to go over to System 2 on the left side and then hit Marketing Area at the very top, number one. And then you can change your language like so. Sorry if I went too fast there. But we're going to show you one more time through tech rep mode through uh, the Japanese language here how to do it. So if it's already in like another language and you want to go through tech rep mode, just follow the keys that I'm doing right here exactly. And this will bring you right back in. You're going to go to the third one down, then the top one, and then you can change your language like so and just give it a while um, I had to hit the button three times you don't have to just one times okay it just takes a little while before it um, it finally registers and then you have uh, some of the others that you can pick as well but uh, this one has Japan US and Europe um, some others I think you can actually use firmware to put to install some others on there I'm just gonna go through it once again just uh, Utility, display keypad, stop zero zero, stop zero one. Third one down, system one, marketing area, and you can change it just like so. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye bye.